So this is my latest pickup from eBay. It's the Diskette Holder TM Diskette. It is the item W6007 by no company name. It is a diskette storage system. It looks like a CRT monitor. Holds 15 discs. It actually has a rotating pedestal like a real CRT. And a drawer to store diskette labels. Made in China. Patent pending. Yeah, I don't know why it doesn't have a company name on it. Maybe it's by diskette holder. So this is actually one I've had for a while. The one I just got was this one which is essentially the same. You can find a lot of these um, on eBay, but usually they have a company name added into this little thing. So they're not sort of generic like this. So how it works, let's do a full 360, so you can see how it works. And yeah, it does have a little adjustable base on it. This one's kind of dirty. But you open this little here, and you got your diskettes. They all slide right in here. Now, you can see at the back there's these sort of funky hinges. The way it works is you slide them to the left and they sort of pop out, making it easy to put them in and out, especially if you have the whole thing completely full. So you don't have to like very carefully try to pull them out. And then it's got that little diskette tray here. Well, it's not actually a diskette tray. In fact, if you... Let's grab one of those discs out. Oops. Can't open it with this open. And it pops right open. Pull it out. Ooh. You slide this out right here. Try to stick a disc in. Nope, won't fit. It is, however, just the right size for disc labels. Slide them in there. So this back here. It's kind of weird that you have to have this little slidey thing on the side. You really could open it just from the sides if they made it a little bigger and it does kind of open nice, but this sort of gives you a secondary way to do it. Kind of a nice idea. So, the real reason I got this is not just to store my discs, because I have plenty of discs and plenty of ways to store them. The real reason I got this is... If you open this up, you can see this little black piece of plastic here is just stuck on right here. And it'd be very easy to pop this out. So my idea was, take one of these, pop out this plastic, use something like this Pi TFT touchscreen. This one's not really the right size. I'll need to get something a little bigger, but it would fit just right. You know, a little bit bigger, fit right inside there. You have a Raspberry Pi inside here. You probably have to drill a hole in the back or use a battery power the thing, actually. Maybe if you could go right through there. Hmm. Maybe. Um, you could have a little sort of mini CRT. Maybe have it run DOS games. It'd be nifty. Now, this particular one, came, when I got it from eBay, came with thumbtacks and a bunch of American flag stickers actually inside there, which I thought was just an oversight, like they hadn't bothered opening it. But it also came with the, um, the order form. So, apparently they intentionally did that. Maybe it's a thing they do. Free thumbtacks and American flags, which sadly are slightly too wide to go on a floppy disk, so it's not like there are even American flag floppy disks, although that'd be kind of silly, it's like, there's no way to label the disk, just what's on this disk? America. America is on this disk. Actually, I think it's Duke Nukem 1, which is kind of American.